We are looking at a 1997 Nissan D21 hardbody with a KA 24E engine and uh, after a blown head gasket I uh, uh, rebuilt the engine, put in some new pistons and rings and had the head reconditioned and so forth, put it all back together again and lo and behold it was uh, surging like crazy. I'll start it now to uh, show you what it sounds like. So from the sound of that surging, you can tell that it was not a mild leak, but that was something really drastic. So that engine definitely sounded like it was sucking air big time. All right, uh, here's my setup for the smoking leak finder machine as requested by the good folks over at infamous Nissan. Uh, this design is uh, taken from a pretty easily findable DIY YouTube video on the subject. It's uh, basically a glass jar filled with an old sock covered in mineral oil, a.k.a. baby oil. And uh, the lid has three holes in it. One uh, for the intake of fresh air. Another one to blow the smoky air out and go into the uh, intake manifold. And I'll put a link in the description to the video that I used to build this thing got a regular bicycle pump over here on the side which is going to push the air through this jar uh, after I plug it in and make it smoky and uh, and then over here I've got the output hose going into uh, the intake manifold so I've got my uh, air filter housing off and I'm looking here at my throttle body and I removed the MAF sensor here and put a little bit of uh, electrical tape around this to make it fit perfectly in here. Just happens to be the size of my hose needed that. And then on the top, to plug up the other two holes, I've got a number 12 rubber plug and a number 000 plug to plug up these two top holes. And uh, that'll and that'll get me all sealed up and so now when the smoke comes through here it'll go into the intake manifold and uh, I'll plug it in now and then uh, start filming again when I look for the smoke and we've got smoke in the smoker and uh, I've got everything hooked up and I'm gonna grab my little pump here which I've just attached to this little rubber thing over here so I can push the smoke through like that you can see the fresh air goes in through this side and pushes all the air into here. So I'm going to start. Now I don't know if you can see this. You may or may not be able to see the smoke. There's a little bit of smoke coming from that uh, BPT. It appears to be coming out the top of it. see that smoke coming out right there at the top of the uh, EGRC dash BPT so that's one that's one place but that's not the worst place the worst place is right in here on this intake manifold let me see if there you go you see that smoke coming out that's coming out between my intake manifold and my cylinder head and I just installed that with a new gasket and I sure thought I put it on right but obviously I didn't because I don't even need the smoke to 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 notice that because if I have this set up without the smoke yeah, I can actually hear the air coming out of there I have one big gaping hole there so there it is uh, smoke coming from over here smoke coming from over here so you can see that I mean if you if you have any leaks, this is a really good way to find them. So there you have it. I found my vacuum leaks and you can too. Hope this helps.